Well, now at 5 o'clock, some Indiana lawmakers want to get more kids enrolled in pre-kindergarten. CBS 4's Kristen Escal explains what's being considered for the new legislative session. You see that progression of them learning those tools. Amy Cavan says she sees the benefits of early childhood education firsthand through her work at Day Early Learning Center. But she's also seen the barriers families face getting their children enrolled. It does become the financial um, burden, um, the available seats. Democratic State Senator Fatty Cadora says that's why he believes the state needs to expand access to pre-K. He sees urgency following last year's iRead scores, which show roughly one in five Hoosier third graders can't read proficiently. That is the most significant and uh, helpful strategy to help students by third grade be able to master reading and improve their math skills. Kadora says he wants Indiana to take steps toward universal pre-K for four-year-olds. He says he also plans to introduce a bill to expand the income eligibility for On My Way Pre-K, a state program providing pre-K grants to low-income families of four-year-olds. There are many families who made a little bit more than the existing eligibility threshold, so they were kicked off of those uh, scholarships. Republican State Senator Jeff Rotz, who chairs the Senate Education Committee, believes the state has more work to do long term before considering pre-K for all four-year-olds. He says he would like to see On My Way Pre-K run by the State Education Department rather than the Family and Social Services Administration. It's a separation of child care versus education in which we've traditionally done move that uh, under the department. Uh, as a beginning point, not necessarily expansion. At the State House, Kristen Escow, CBS 4 News. Kristen, thank you.